5. The Island of Dolls. This looks like such a lovely little island of the coast of Mexico. Up close, this island is full of terrifying looking dolls hanging everywhere. Rumor has it that a little girl drowned in a canal on the island of Lyola de los Muncas in front of its owner, Don Julian Santana, who believed her spirit haunted the place. People say he became crazy with fear and started to collect dolls to save himself from her. He gathered them from trash heaps and sold people vegetables in exchange for dolls, which he then stashed in trees on the ground and even impaled dolls' heads on spikes, 1,500 of them altogether. Now, they are just left there to rot, and from a distance, some of them look like the bodies of real children hanging in the trees. 4. Pompeii, Italy. This town, near Mount Vesuvius, a pretty massive volcano, has a collection of living statues. Yes, I say living, they were alive in Roman times. Until, one day, the volcano erupted with huge clouds of volcanic ash, raining down on the village. The ash then covered the people of the village, and solidified, turning them into human statues. Creepy. 3. Herxham Cannibal Village, Germany. Now, a lovely village in southwest Germany, but back in the Stone Age. A mass grave for victims of ritual cannibalism. The bodies of men, women, children and even a fetus were expertly skinned, and the bones had tool marks that showed the flesh had been cut off. Bones were exposed for the marrow to be eaten. Smashed skulls were found, meaning the brain had been taken out. Injuries on some skeletons showed the people had been spit, roasted. 2. Takokan Onuma Amusement Park, Japan. Opened in the mid 1970s, the park swiftly closed after two years. Many said there was a lot of mysterious deaths that happened, and those are why they shut it down. It was opened again in 1986, but after 10 years and more mysterious deaths, it closed its doors for a final time. 1. The said Lake, Oswari. What a lovely church, is what you can imagine, most people would say, when, walking past this church, in the Czech Republic. But go inside, and it's a totally, different story. Everything is made, with bones, the bones of between, 40,000 to 70,000 people, to be more precise. Sandalier, that's made out of skulls, and bones, with a few rumpeting cherubs thrown in. Wall, decoration, made out of, you guessed it, skulls and bones. The church was the inspiration for Dr. Satan's. Thanks for watching. Comment what you guys want from this channel. Love you all. I will meet you in my next video.